Why do bodybuilders use testosterone boosters? Shouldn't a guy be able to build muscle on his own? Men build more muscle on their own than a woman could, because of their natural levels of testosterone. However, to get ripped in a short period of time or build amazing muscles, he needs testosterone boosters. I heard of teenagers saying they needed it to build muscle. They do better to get off the couch and get moving than take a lot of pills. And teenagers shouldn't use testosterone, because they're already overloaded on it already. Yeah. Fathers routinely have to threaten to kill them to counteract the impulses the hormones cause. I saw your dad's shirt. Guns don't kill people. Fathers of pretty daughters do. But guys build muscles to impress girls, not their fathers. And to impress other guys. It's a more practical version of the peacock's tail. The guy with the bigger biceps wins the competition and gets more requests to help people move. So guys use the testosterone boosters as much to get bragging rights with each other as they do to get better bodies. They have to be careful, because a lot of nutritional supplements and bodybuilding products are not as healthy as people think. A few are downright dangerous. Can't they get testosterone boosters from their doctor? Unless a teenager isn't developing from insufficient testosterone, no. This isn't a standard thing. Neither is creatine. True, but creatine has decades of research proving its safety and effectiveness. And testosterone boosters don't? Not nearly as much. And not nearly as much as whey protein. Whey goes all the way back to Miss Muffet. Excuse me? Little Miss Muffet sits on her tuffet, eating her curds and whey. That's more like cottage cheese than a bodybuilding supplement. Just proving that it's been known to be good for you for a really long time.